everybody? My name is Bradley Davis, and I'm so excited to join the WAPT team, helping Joe and Rob to continue to bring you the best local sports coverage in Jackson. Just a little bit about myself. I'm originally from the Dallas, Texas area, but I went to school at the University of Missouri, so very familiar with SEC football. But right now, I'm at Jackson Academy Football Stadium, where I get to catch up with another new face in town who's trying to develop the Raiders into a state championship powerhouse. From Alabama to Mississippi, it wasn't easy for head coach Aubrey Blackwell to make the move to JA. We left family, we left mom and dad and grandparents to be here at, at Jackson Academy. A move made easier by the strong community felt at Jackson Academy. It's an um, outstanding group of people. Um, you know, I, I'm, I'm really honored and blessed to be able to work for an outstanding administration, people that really want, that really cared about where this program's moving. Um, there's outstanding people and kids here, love this community. Blackwell earned a strong reputation for his program development with Montgomery Catholic High School in Alabama, leading three 10 plus win seasons in six years. He intends to do the same with Jackson Academy. We're building from the ground up. I, I'm working with our fifth and sixth graders. I'm working with our junior high um, on a daily basis right now. Even in the summertime, I coached both. And because we want to develop a program that starts from our smallest point that really reaches to develop our Jackson Academy kids, those that grew up here, that wear, that wear the navy and gray and have a passion for being here that's what's really fun and that's what we want to do the work of blackwell and his coaching staff has already earned the respect from the senior leadership on the team as hunter said brought us together more than family and even coach duggan he's been everywhere so um he knows what it's like to be the best and uh so he's pushing us hard every day to make us better and while ja helped blackwell transition across states he quickly returned the favor to his primary signal caller clayton white helping him make his transition from wide receiver to quarterback he's made it super easy uh he's really cut down the offense and explained it to me and we've watched a ton of film and stuff so I feel like I'm ready for the challenge. Newly behind center, White has his sights set on September 16th, where J.A. takes on MRA. It's definitely circled on the schedule. Where he won't just be up against a conference rival, but his cousin and best friend John White, who starts a quarterback for the Patriots. We always talk smack at Christmas, Thanksgiving, all that type of stuff. I've been thinking about it since last year. Just, I mean, they beat us out of the semifinals game, and uh, I heard about it from my cousin all year long, so I'm ready whenever we play him. Blackwell says he gets the excitement around the big rivals, but his focus is on the personal development of his guy. We, we want to build young men. We're about developing our guys and our student athletes here at Jackson Academy. JA opens at Starkville Academy on August 19th at 7 p.m. Reporting in Jackson, Bradley Davis, WAPT Sports. All right. Thank you, Bradley, and welcome. What a great addition. Absolutely. Want to give you a live look outside.